Good afternoon. This is Mark with Southwest Florida Auto. Today I'm going to be showing you a 1971 Rolls-Royce Silver Shadow with only 84,000 original miles on it. Now the exterior of this vehicle is in a pretty decent shape. As you can clearly see, it's got the original paint on it. Still shiny. I mean, it's absolutely beautiful on the outside. Now, the license plate is a little bit, um, just a little discolored, but not too bad, as you can clearly see. But other than that, it's in really good shape. There's one little chip here I see. There's a couple of dings here. But not too bad. But other than that, it's in great shape. Now I'm going to get a close up of the top. Um, the top's in okay shape. Um, it is going to need some restoration up here. Um, there's no major damage to it, but I, um, the back's going to need to be all taken care of and I'll show you what the inside's doing. I just wanted to get you a close up of the top. The tires are in great shape. It seems to be newer tires on there. I will give you a close-up of those as well. There's the tread. Oh, I do see a scrape right here, it looks like. Um, on the exterior of that. There's a, co a, a couple of bumbles with the paint right here, as you can clearly see. Now over to the back tire. The tread is in pretty good shape. Now, give me one moment and let me go ahead and pop the hood. All right, thank you for patiently waiting. I wanted to show you everything's in decent shape under here. I am gonna walk to the other side so I can show you as well. Now what I am going to go ahead and do is turn on the vehicle so you can see how it starts starts up right away for you and then we'll go into the interior and I'll show you every one of the doors and what, what's going on with it, how it runs. As you can hear it starts up immediately.
All right, let me go ahead and close that. I do want to show you the trunk as well, and then we'll go to the interior. Now you do have a couple of, um, just a little bit of damage there. But other than that, we just purchased a brand new battery for this vehicle. And everything else is really clean. All right, now, um, the inside is going to need a little TLC. It is going to need a little bit of work. Um, like here, the weather stripping, as you can clearly see, um, needs some needs some work on the leather. I mean, on the weather stripping. Um, the only window that works is the rear right. Um, it needs restoration done on the seats, as you can clearly see. Let me just go ahead and sit down and then we'll take it for a ride in a moment. I'm gonna apply the gas so you can hear it. But once this is fixed up to par, this is going to be a really nice, really nice car. We need some, uh, you need some new carpet in here. Some vinyl on there. This weather stripping is a little, that just needs to be clean. back seat I'll go ahead and show you the back in a moment um, it does this side um, is in pretty decent shape as you can clearly see the leather the back by the window I will explain what's going on over there when we get on that side of the vehicle. This panel is in pretty decent shape. That just needs some chrome cleanup. And a new weather stripping. The floor, the carpet on this side is not as bad as the front. Now the back, it seems to be, um, seems to have either a slight leak or something going on with that back. So you would have to take that apart and see what's going on there. The leather on this one is also And not of a good shape. I know it doesn't leak from up here. It just leaks down there. So I don't know if outside, but um, I'll give you a close up of everything there. It just may need a new sealer here and then a new piece in the inside. Um, but that's just going off of what, what it looks like. But this is the only window that operates. This side is not in too bad shape. The weather stripping, you may need to get a new one of that, like I advised before. I'm gonna go ahead and sit down in this. So you're gonna need a new weather strip up here as well. That one's a little dry rotted. The 
glove box. Alright, now what we'll do is I'm going to go on the um, other side and I'm going to show you how it drives. But I have to say, it does drive really smooth. It runs nicely. Let me go ahead and... Here we go. I love the old-fashioned steering wheels. I think they're totally cool. It drives really nice. All right, sorry, we're at a red light. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and go. Steering's nice, I think because of the new tires, but it drives really nice. As you can clearly see, we're already up to 50 miles an hour. And as you can clearly see, it runs great. The horn even works. All right, well, we're coming down to the end of the test drive. Um, if you have any questions or concerns or will, um, have any, would like any more information, just please let me know and I'll be happy to get you that information. Um, you can reach me at 239-690-3123. That phone number one more time is 239-690-3123. Again, my name is Mark with Southwest Florida Auto and I would like you to thank you for joining with us today. Have a great day.